Even though Hedge from Beard meets Beers, hope you're all doing well. Um, Tall Boy Cons, um, just a little, silly little mini series, um, more of a supermarket haul type little video. But it'll make sense when we get to the last one. But again, quick overview on these one, this one, of these ones. Um, yes, I'll be trying a drink, this one. Um, and then, like I say, another two videos, these two, then after. Um, and then, obviously, in the last one, this one, I'll let you know what the uh, big surprise is. Again, we need a proper, we need a proper little mini series, which again, we'll get to that after this one. But again, like I say, this one, just a, a fun little video for me, um, just expressing my love of New England IPAs. Um, <laughs> and these are um, ones I picked up at Tesco. Most Tesco's, decent sized Tesco's, will have these, and they all range at three quid a can for a 440. So it's not nothing to be stumped about. Again, just quickly go over what we've got in front of us, but each video I'll go in further detail what it is. Um, so again, first one, we've got the Sol and, I'm gonna butch this one already, um, Panona Island Collab, which is the shoot. Um, again, New England IPA. In the middle, OG Hazy by Brewdog. Um, very nice, it's, it's a very, very tropically drink, but again, we'll get to that in a warm. And then, obviously, we'll save Northern Monk one, Scaffold, I hope. That's correct. Uh, that'll be the last one, and then obviously a little bit on there. So, assistant. No, jokes. <laughs> I'm not, like, not getting there yet. But yeah, like I say, Shoop is his first one. Um, picked this one up at, again, as I said, Tesco, £3 for a 440 can. Um, I love it. It is it's a very tasty can. Again, like I said in a previous video, I want to do something just a little bit, a little bit fun before I tell you all. What I got planned, um, but yeah, like I say, I love New England, so why not have a couple of videos where I'm just drinking New England? It seems like a good idea to me, and obviously I'm going to enjoy it. <laughs> so yeah, if you haven't joined us before, I appreciate you stopping by. Hello, uh, if you are returning, hats off to you. Yeah, no, I appreciate. It. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, I'll talk a little bit about the beer, have a little sniff, give it a pour. Have a sniff, have a drink, have a drink, talk a little bit and let it go anyway. So, we're not going to mess around, we'll jump straight into it because I'm already taking up almost three minutes just chatting rubbish. So, yeah, quickly on this one, again, like I say, it's a collab and it is a very tasty collab, so, yeah. Again, looking forward to this one. So, again, this is Sol and Panona Island and this is the shoot. Um, it's a 6.4 in a 440 can, as I say. Three quid, obviously from Tesco. Um, give you a little read on the back, because we always have a little read. And then, like I say, give it a pour, have a drink, and then let you go on your little merry way. <laughs> um, so, Salt and Phenomena Island present Shoop. It's awesome. Already, spoiler alert, it's awesome. Um, a New England IPA packed and stacked with tropical hop aromas. Uh, we dipped into a bag of tricks to bring you a juicy New England IPA. They're not wrong. It is very, very tasty. Um... A smooth bodied and low in bitterness, again, very true. Um, not shy with dry hop or Vic Secret, Enigma. I would have butchered this one completely. Um, and more, I, you know what, I can't pronounce it. I'll get back to on that one. <laughs> um, Asex aromas of passion fruit, lime, pineapple, and melon. Super duper duper. Yeah, so, shoot, collab, it's absolutely tasty. So, not gonna mess around. Crack it open, get in, and yeah, I'll let you know what's going to I mean, as I said, up back, it is it's tropically, right? <clears throat> it is, again, you, you get to smell it. Like I say, only a little bit on end when it's open, but again, it is very, very fruity already. Oh, it's all here, look at that. Straight in. Not going to mess it up, though. Uh, I messed it up. Oh. I tried. Right, I'll, let, <laughs> I'll let that settle. Um, but yeah, like I say, it's only going to be a, a, a three part little mini series of New England's because, again, I just want to show my appreciation for New England's and, you know, tell you where I get them from. And again, again like I say, they are, they are they are all very tasty drinks and that's the reason why I picked these three specific ones for this purpose here video. So, I just 
I've still got a bit in there as well. I've got too much I've done this. Right, be kind in the comments because I know I just butchered it. <laughs> right, we're in. So as I say, shoot, Salt and Penon Ryland collab. Honestly, it's very, very tasty. Um, hey, all faithful. Can't have it. Can't have drink about it. Again, like you say, you're getting, you're still getting out the, the fruity tropical notes on it. On the nose, which is always good. I'm going in. I am going in. I'm almost damn down then. Cheers. <clears throat> oh, it's a taste one. Honestly, it is. If you tried it and you like it, you know what I'm talking about. Like I say, you're getting <clears throat> you're getting mouthfuls of tropical flavour fruit. You're getting like the the sweet bitterness of pineapple. Again, I love pineapple, so it's not it's not going to go amiss. But like I say, it's just it's just so fruity. It's a really really tasty drink. I've got nothing in the bottom of this one. Probably because I'm butchered it. Better off my moustache then. But yeah, like I say, it's very it's, like I say, it's a nice nice tasting drink. Like I said, the aromas, like I say, coming out of the glass, you can still smell them. They're very, very nice. Like I said, very fruity, very tropical, and that's that's what I like about like the New England's because again, it, they are just so fruity. Like they like jam packed of fruit, they're, like so juicy, and that's I think that's what I particularly like about the New England's compared to like a an Indian pale ale or just a pale ale. Where it's just they are nice, but they are just lacking something. <clears throat> New England's, however, like I said, they just honestly just get a smack in your mouth of fruit. <laughs> <laughs> like I say, as I said, I love it. I'm I'm an advocate of New England's and the more I can try, the better. So I'm gonna go back in. <clears throat> you don't lose anything. Like I say, it's like I say, it's such a very it's not it's not a strong Tropical, like it's overpowering because it's not. It's just very flavoursome. Like I say, you get mouthfuls of fruit whilst you're drinking it. And if that's your thing, that's not my thing. Um, yeah, <laughs> three quid, it's, it's a bargain. Um, but yeah, like I say, I mean, I think this is the. Now, I think it's the third time I've tried it. So obviously, it's something that I knew I'd, I'd be enjoying anyway. But like I say, you can pick these up in. Most decent supermarkets. I got these specifically from Tesco, as I say, because they've got a, probably one of the finer <laughs> selection of um, craft ales. And then, like I say, you've got you've got Morrison's again. I've got a decent selection. Sainos, well, Sainsbury's uh, for the less common folk. <laughs> um, yeah, like I say, Sainsbury's got they've got fairly decent. As the it's got your. You know, you, it's got all your brew dogs and all that time thing, but I think they're kind of lacking. Um, yeah, they're, they're lacking slightly in it. Tesco, again, thumbs up for me. They've got, again, decent selection of craft beer. But yeah, not to say, it's absolutely, it's such a tasty little drink. I'll have one more. I like it anyway. It is, honestly, it's so fruity. It's a it's a very tasty drink. As I say, Salt and Panona Island present Shoop New England IPA. Winner winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> As always, I appreciate you stopping by. I generally do take your time out your busy day. Come and check me just being stupid, laughing at myself. Checking this this out. Checking these out. I won it. System. Checking these out. Again, like I say, it's massively appreciated. It really is. So I don't want you to ever think that it's not appreciated because it is. Um, but yeah, I hope you all take care. Stay safe. And until the next one, stay safe. Head you out.